Oh, oh, oh. Welcome to Washoe County Library System's Jammies and Jingles program. I'm Santa Claus from the North Pole. And today, you'll be having some Christmas fun while staying warm and toasty in your jammies. If you're ready, say jingle jingle. Hey, that reminds me of a song. Santa, that reminds me of a song too. My name is Miss Lisa and I'm from the Northwest Reno Library and we're gonna sing Jingle Bells. Are you ready? Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one horse open sleigh. Hey, jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one horse open sleigh. We're dashing through the snow in a one horse open sleigh. Or the fields we go laughing all the way. Ha, 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 bells on bobtails ring. enjoying jammies and jingles as much as I am. My name is Morgan and I'm here with a special rhyme about our favorite reindeer. Who is it? Rudolph. Oh, something's missing. Rudolph, Rudolph, what will you do? You can't guide Santa if your nose is... What color? Blue. Is that right though? No. Rudolph, Rudolph, you're such a silly fellow. You can't guide Santa if your nose is... What color? Yellow. Good job. Is that right, though? Hmm, I don't think so. Rudolph, Rudolph, you won't be seen through the wintry weather if your nose is... What color? Green. Good job. Wait, though, is that right? I don't think so. Rudolph, Rudolph, Santa gave you a wink. But you can't help him if your nose is, what color? Pink, good job. Is that right, is Rudolph's nose pink? Hmm, I don't think so. Rudolph, Rudolph, it's time to fly at night. But you can't help Santa if your nose is, what color? White, good job. I still don't think that's right though, hmm. Let's try this again. Rudolph, Rudolph, it's time to go to town. But you can't help Santa if your nose is, what color? Brown, good job. Is that right? No. Rudolph, Rudolph, Santa has his sack. But you can't guide him in the dark if your nose is, what color? Black, still not right. Hmm. Rudolph, Rudolph, all the children are in bed. Santa's ready, and I know you are because your nose is, what color? Red. Is that right? It is Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. Huh, that makes me think of a song. Did you guys just hear an elf shaking presents? Oh! Hello! Welcome! I'm an elf from Northwest Reno Library. Did you know the library has elves? What? You didn't? Well, who do you think makes all the beautiful puppets? Aww. Here's one I made. Are you ready? Oh yeah. Pretty cool, huh? Anyway, would you like to read one of my favorite festive stories with me today? 
You would? Fantastic! It's called The Night Before Christmas, and we're reading it with permission from HarperCollins Publishers. It's written by Clement Seymour and illustrated. The pictures are drawn by Mary Engelbright. Let's take a look. Look at all those elves. The Night Before Christmas by Clement C. Moore and illustrated by Mary Engelbright. Twas the night before Christmas when all through the house not a creature was stirring, not even a mouse. The stockings were hung by the chimney with care in the hopes that St. Nicholas soon would be there. Can you see that little mouse fast asleep? What's he sleeping in? You're right, it's a teacup. That's a perfect place for a mouse to sleep, huh? The children were nestled all snug in their beds, while visions of sugar plums danced in their heads. And Mama in her kerchief and I in my cap had just settled down for a long winter's nap. Everyone's fast asleep. When out on the lawn there arose such a clatter, I sprang from my bed to see what was the matter. Away to the window I flew like a flash, tore open the shutters and threw up the sash. What do you think he could see? Any guesses? Who would be out there on the night before Christmas? Shall we read and find out? Oh, who's that? It's Santa Claus, you're right! The moon on the breast of the new fallen snow gave the luster of midday to objects below, when what to my wondering eyes should appear but a miniature sleigh and eight tiny reindeer. Can you count the reindeer with me? One, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight. Well done. Santa's arrived. Let's see what happens next. With a little old driver so lively and quick, I knew in a moment it must be Saint Nick. More rapid than eagles his courses they came, and he whistled and shouted and called them by name. What sound does Santa make? Do you know? Ho, 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 ho. Can you laugh like Santa? Ho, 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 ho. Good job. Let's see what he named his reindeer. Now Dasher, now Dancer, now Prancer, now Vixen, on Comet, on Cupid, on on Donna, on and Blitzen, to the top of the porch, to the top of the wall. Now dash away, dash away, dash away all. <gasps> Look at those beautiful reindeer. As dry leaves that before the wild hurricane fly, when they meet with an obstacle, mount to the sky. So up to the housetop the courses they flew, with the sleigh full of toys and St. Nicholas too. Can you see all the toys in the back of uh, Santa Claus's sleigh? Me too. Let's see what he does with them. And then, in a twinkling, I heard on the roof the prancing and pawing of each little hoof. As I drew in my head and was turning around, down the chimney St. Nicholas came with a bound. Do you know what a bound is? It's like a big leap with lots of energy. I'll let you take a look at that picture. He was dressed all in fur from his head to his foot, and his clothes were all tarnished with ash and soot. 
a bundle of toys he had flung on his back, and he looked like a peddler just opening his pack. Can you see Santa with all his toys? Maybe even the little kitty will get a toy this year, if he's been good. His eyes, how they twinkled. His dimples, how merry. His cheeks were like roses, his nose like a cherry. What color is a cherry? Is it green? No. Is it blue? Are you sure? I guess you can't have a blue nose, huh? It's red, you're right, he had a red nose just like a cherry. His droll little mouth was drawn up like a bow, and the, and the beard of his chin was as white as the snow. <sighs> the stump of his pipe he held tight in his teeth, and the smoke it encircled his head like a wreath all around. He had a broad face and a little round belly that shook when he laughed like a bowl full of jelly. Can you laugh like Santa? Ho, 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 ho. Can you laugh and make your, and make your stomach jiggle like a bowl full of jelly? Let's try. Ho, 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 ho. Merry Christmas. Good job. Pretty fun, huh? I'll let you take a look at this picture quickly. He was chubby and plump and a right jolly old elf. And I laughed when I saw him in spite of myself. A wink of his eye, ding, and a twist of his head soon gave me to know I had nothing to dread. He spoke not a word, but went straight to his work and filled all the stockings, then turned with a jerk. And laying his fingers aside of his nose and giving a nod up the chimney, he rose. Can you see Santa disappearing up the chimney? Look, you can only see his boot. He's off to the next house. He sprang to his sleigh, to his team gave a whistle, and away they all flew like the dawn of a thistle. But I heard him exclaim, ere he drove out of sight, Merry Christmas to all, and to all a good night. The end. The night before Christmas by Clement C. Moore and Mary Englebright. Did you like that book? Well, I'm so glad you got to read it with me today. Thank you for joining me in my workshop and I'll hope I'll see you again soon. Goodbye. Oh, elves are so helpful and wasn't that a great story? Thanks for joining us today. I hope you had fun. If you missed any of today's program or you want to see more of our virtual programs, visit us at WashoeCountyLibrary.us, our Facebook page, or our YouTube channel. Happy Holidays from Washoe County Library System. And I wish you all a Merry Christmas. Oh, 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 oh.